Hi, me again. So part two of a little bit about me. I did not even talk about my child or my husband. I don't know why. <laughs> Again, I'm I'm learning how to do all this uh, the podcasting jazz and um, and uh, maybe I should do little notes, you know, so I don't spend too much time talking about one thing and can definitely um, you know remember to talk about other things. So I am married. I've been married for uh, two years now. We got married in uh, right before COVID really, um, in 2019, October, 2019. So we, yes, some of you are going to hate me. We were those people that were able to get married and go on our honeymoon and then come back and celebrate the holidays. And, um, we got the travel bug out of our, um, we, you know, it took us a while to get bit by the travel bug again with COVID because we were able to um, go abroad and and um, yes I hope I hope no one's unfollowing me because I just said that um, and yeah we we met when we when we were supposed to if I had met him earlier nope if I had met him later nope it was, we met at a yoga studio and I won't get too into it, but, um, I fell in love with his dog, then liked, fell in love with him. And, uh, he makes me a better person and challenges me every single day. And is the reason why I take time to get to know my emotions and don't rush through life. We both find play in everything. Half of our arguments are about not being playful enough that day, along with others, but, and he is just such a, such a gift to, to me and my family and my, and my, you know, my daughter, of course. Um, and then little Miss Z, rock star y'all will get to know her so well she's kind of the leader of this show she's deaf yeah she's ceo i uh, maybe coo i help with the operational side of things and um and she is my vision for life and she brings so much joy to me and teaches me too many things. Sometimes I'm like, teacher, time out. I, I'm spent. I am, I'm out for the day. And I can just spend hours looking at that kid. And I, she is going to, you know, bring up topics and bring up everything that I'm wanting to talk to, talk to all y'all about. And, and, um, like, yeah, just, just so much, so much, so much, so much, so much. And I love being able to see another mom when they're going through something like say, say my child is, is screaming in the grocery line and I look and I see another mom and she's looking at me and it's just that knowing, just that knowing that this too shall pass. You are not alone. I'm a regular mom, you're a regular mom, we're doing this together and, and we're doing, we're doing it, we're doing it. And I, you know, we hope to have another child. I'm not going to be that person. It's like, Hey guys, we're trying. Um, uh, so yeah, so, you know, hope to have that be part of that, the experience that I get to share with everybody. And, um, you know, had a great pregnancy with, with, with Zena and a very entertaining birth with Zena and you, uh, you know, every, who knows what the next one or the next one or the next one or the next one, uh, will bring, but I, I will be sharing that 
that with all of you as well. And um, uh, yes, I just, I wanted to jump back on because it's one of, it's my husband and my daughter are an extremely important part of my life for, for very obvious reasons and for not so much, not so obvious reasons. So I didn't want them to be forgotten and they weren't forgotten. They just, they weren't in my, my little notes. My little, my, I just, I just forgot. Um, but that is just a little bit more about me. So hopefully y'all tuned in and uh, look forward to tomorrow where we talk about letting go and letting God. And that's another thing that I tend to do. I tend to sing my words. I may have gotten that from my mother, but um, sorry, not sorry. Love you all. <laughs>